Hi, I'm Chef Simon Bridges with Goddess Food Factory, and today we're making some delicious breakfast. We're making some pancakes, eggs, bacon, and grits. Mm -mm -mm. Doesn't that sound delicious? I know it does. So I'm going to top my pancakes off with a selection of peaches and bananas, and top my eggs and my eggs and my grits off with some cheese. So we're going to start by just preheating all of our eyes. So I'm going to turn that on to high so the butter can start melting for my pancakes. And then we're going to turn on my eye for my bacon. Oh, I love bacon. And I'm going to turn that on to high also. So now while all my eyes are heating, I'm just going to start by making the bacon. So I'm going to make my bacon sizzly. Hey, hey, shimmy, 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 yeah, yeah. Okay, so I'm going to take my tongs and sit them right here because I want to make sure they're ready so I won't have to like when the bacon sizzle so I can go ahead and flip it. So now that my butter is melting, I'm just going to move it around a little bit, just like so. And now I'm going to put my pancake, my pancake base on. I'm all done to tell y'all two ingredients I put in my pancakes. Cinnamon, sugar. I love cinnamon, especially when I'm making like toppings like peaches and bananas, because they go together really well. And I put sugar in it because I like a little bit of sweetness to my um, pancakes, so I don't have to add any syrup. Some people like syrup and I like the natural um, taste, so I put pure sugar cane, pure sugar cane sugar, and um, I like the natural sweet taste from the fruit, so that's what I use. I'm just going to pour a little bit inside of the pan so that it can start cooking. Oh, and you guys, it smells so good. It smells so delicious. I'm just going to turn this on medium, which is like medium low, so it can start cooking. And now my bacon is cooking, so I'm going to um my my grits to start to be boiling, and I can see this got boiling. So while my bacon is cooking, I'm just going to take my eggs over here. And you want to make sure you put in a little bit of butter. A little bit of butter, like towards like the bottom of the pan, so that it can start heating a little bit. And then the bacon, the bacon sizzling over here. So you know what that means. I take my tongs and I get ready to flip my bacon. So you want to constantly flip it because you want to be aware of like which side of your bacon is cooking first, so you can know like by the time. And I love bacon. I am a bacon fan. I'm glad they made something to such animal as pigs because oh, without pigs you wouldn't have sausage, you wouldn't have bacon. But my favorite thing is turkey bacon. I know bacon is a little bit um, not healthy, but turkey bacon, you can't go wrong with turkey bacon. But this is regular bacon. Now that that's that that cooking, I'm going to just get ready for my um. I'm going to get ready for a container that I'm going to pour in my juicy drink. So I'm going to put that back into my milk and my orange juice out. I can have something to pour the milk when I get my cup. For you know presentation, so I have these two little glasses. I'm gonna pour one in milk because my family loves milk. And again, I'm making this meal for my family in the morning. Right now, my family is all in bed. Yesterday, it was kind of very exhausting because I was helping my mother 
yesterday with lavish woman and stuff. So it was kind of exhausting. So I figured that she would want to wake up to a nice breakfast. So I figured that I would just make some pancakes, eggs, bacon, and grits. And with some orange juice and milk. Okay, so. Now, I'm just going to flip my um, bacon over, turn my pancakes up a little high, see so now you know that your pancake, your bacon is cooking. So I know that it's only a little bit of time for my bacon to finish. Oh, it's not so good. Woo! Oh, it's not so good. You guys. Oh, no, you guys. I was trying to be here to see it. It tastes how delicious. This meal is going to be today. Ooh, it's going to be so good. So, now that my grits is boiling and com coming to a boil, as you can see, we're going to start by, I'm going to put my grits inside of this. I added in three cups of water. So now, I'm going to put in some, I'm going to put in one cup. I'm going to turn the um, grits high on medium high because you want it to still boil, but not boil too much that it um, overloads over the pot. So, put in a cup of grits. And a half. little bit of salt and pepper and butter with the water and mix it a little bit and then I like to put in some I'm talking about with the grit and then I like to put in a little bit of um grit and then what I do is I put salt and pepper first because salt and pepper is the key ingredient to anything So, we're finished with the bacon, so I can do I can move that aside over there, and I can put this up here. Okay, I'm going to start letting that warm up a little bit. And now, I'm going to check on my pancakes. Ooh, it looks delicious. On this side, this side looks delicious. See how beautiful this pancake looks? Look at it. Look how beautiful it looks. Okay, so I'm just gonna mix my grits a little bit more. Looks like so. Just gonna continue to mix my grits. Okay. Gonna pat down my pancakes a little bit so they can just start cooking a little bit more. And you want to clean up as you go. So make sure you clean up as you go. 
But if you do that, you'll always have a clean space so you won't have to clean up afterwards as much. Okay, so my grits are kind of ready. So I'm going to just take that there and get a top. So, now I'm going to check on my pancakes again just to see how they are looking, just to see how my pancakes are looking. Okay, pancakes look delicious right now. I guess I'm going to make about like two to three pancakes. You can make a lot of pancakes with this mix, but for right now, I'm just going to make a two to three pancakes for a plate for you guys. So, let's see, I'm just going to get my, okay, let's move this to the side first. Okay, so I'm just gonna get my plate and my little bowl for my grits. And we're gonna set it over here. Okay, and ooh, this pancake is so good. I'm gonna set this over here. And make some more. I'm gonna put a little bit more butter in here. You want to make sure your pancakes are extra, extra thick. I love my pancakes thick. I love them thick. Because that way they cook a little bit better. And when you bite into the pancakes, it's not so slim like, like a, um, um, what are those called? Like, you know how you have, like, the, um, those, you know, they'll be, like, flat, flat, flat. And you fold them over. Anyways. So, yeah, but those are good too. So I'm just gonna mix up my pancakes a little bit more. As you can see, just like that. I'm gonna fold them over, and you see how delicious those pancakes look? I'm gonna mix up my grits a little bit more. So I said pancakes. Don't want the pancakes to get dry. You want them to always stay moist so they can like, um, like be like kind of like soupy, but not like too soupy, so that it won't be like coming in in like clumps. They'll still have that like look nice soapy type of way. That's perfect. So now you can turn the pancakes off. I meant the grits eye off. <sighs> I don't know what's wrong with me today. I'm just not waking up. So my brain's kind of not <laughs> functioning right. So now I'm just going to put in some, I'm just going to put some bacon on the plate a little bit. Bacon. I love me some bacon, you guys. I'm putting in one. Two and three. Three pieces of bacon. And the other two is gonna be free. This is my mom. This is my mom's plate. She doesn't know I'm making her breakfast this morning. So hopefully she's gonna be surprised and she's gonna be happy. Okay, so I see that's kind of forming into a pancake, so I'm just going to turn it up high a little bit more so that I can full, fully cook the bottom of the pancake thoroughly, so when I flip it, it won't be so hot. 
so now I'm going to start over here with my eggs and I'm going to um, turn it on a little bit to like, like I guess like low because eggs kind of like cook very fast so I'm going to turn it on low and I'm just going to put it on my eggs so let's see gonna start cooking and what I do with my eggs I put some salt and pepper and eggs and I mix it like mix it real good because it takes a couple of seconds for me to mix it so it can be like mixed like really nice okay so now that I finished with my pancakes and my Okay, and I'm mixing and mixing and mixing. Now I'm just going to come over here to my eggs and I'm just going to stir them up. And then I'm going to take my pancake and I'm going to, oh, it's ready, it's ready. See how quick that slipped up? So I'm just going to put it on top of the pancake. Like that. Okay, and I'm going to get ready to put my next pancake. You know what? I think, I think that's enough pancake for you guys. I'm just going to make the other pancakes off camera and I'm going to show you how to finish the product. So now I'm just going to put in some of my grease. I love cheese on top of my grits also, so I'm going to put some cheese on top of my grits too. And then you gotta fit in the dairy. Because dairy helps you grow. Grits. My grits right here. Oh, it looks so delicious, you guys. I'm going to put in a little bit of cheese. the delicious toppings you guys so I'm going to take my other side like on my other video I'm going to chop 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 the fruit Coming for 
the queen, that's a far cry. I, I come around with a snack time. I come up with the game plan while I'm in the kitchen. Ooh, so I don't like the little stringy parts at the end of the minute, so I like to those parts of the And then I just take a knife. You see how cute this knife looks? It's so cute. I don't even want to mess it up. I'm just going to chop it. Hit that top. You guys might have know well. Isn't the goddess girl a girl that bakes? It's called Goddess Food Factory. So I bake and I cook. It's a factory of baking and cooking. So I'm just gonna put it in the top. Just like that. You know what? I'm gonna mix it up. Bananas and peaches. So I'm gonna bananas. One with peaches. The natural sweet taste that these peaches give, and the bananas, oh, it's so delicious. It's so like that, delicious breakfast. We have bacon, eggs, grits, bananas, pancakes, with peaches, and bananas. Oh, and it looks so good. Make sure you follow me on all social media sites, Goddess Food Jets. And make sure you share all my photos and videos with the hashtag of Got Food Factory. And I'll catch y'all later on another episode of Cooking with Simone.